Senna. Pals. I like monkeys. Yeah. I was not born Year of the Monkey. I was born Year of the Pig. This is Year of the Dragon coming up. Mm-hmm. But my rising star sign is um, a fish. Is it really? I don't know what I just said. I'm just making things up now. <laughs> what is going on, everybody? I'm Jabby Kawai, joined by Chara Kirk. What's up? We are finally looking at the trailer to Monkey Man after a lot of rage for not doing so. So, so many people asking, why haven't you looked at this trailer? Look at it, it's amazing. And I'm like, okay, okay. So we're looking at it now. Thanks so much for being here. Subscribe, bell icon, all notifications. Vote this up. Let YouTube know you enjoy what you watch here when you're watching stuff here. Ooh, ooh, ah, ah. Okay, the very last thing before we get into the trailer, just want to remind you guys that we've got something cool coming soon. It's a teaser to a project that Achara Kirk and I produced together. It's called Love Punch Kill. And yeah, I'm really proud of it, as I know Jabby is as well. He's actually been working tirelessly on the edit for the teaser, as well as for the finished products and that will be coming out in about two weeks time right jabby the full length version will come out in two weeks time but the teaser will come out in a couple of days yes 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 so keep a look out for that love punch kill Ooh. close your eyes and you will find yourself oh okay when i was a boy my mother used to tell me a story Stop. You're doing Hanuman? And his army. They brought fire and data to the land. Oh my gosh. Until they faced the protector of the people. Ooh. The white monkey. There you are. You are a beast. What? In this city, the rich don't see us as people. Give me the job no one wants to do. I'll do it. Anyone who forgets their place, it doesn't turn out well for them. Whoa! Wow, Dev! It's not a place to work if you can't handle that sort of stuff. Yay! Oh, hey! Every day. Prayed for a way to protect the weak. I've got an answer to every prayer. I call her Nikki. Minaj, big bumper, <laughs> nice headlights. Let's boogie. <laughs> I was expecting the fast car. They got me. Classic. Whoa. Oh, what did the fishies do to you? We need to fight oh. for your mother, for all of us. Anger will not quiet your soul, my son. Oh, goodness. Don't call me son. Time to remember who you are. Oh, goodness. Dang. Oh, my gosh. Fast and Furious rickshaws, indeed. Just one small ember can burn down everything. Mark you. Ladies and gentlemen, are you ready for a fight? Oh. Dang. Yeah. This looks dope. This looks dope. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Did you have fun, Achara? I had so much fun. Also, love the addition of the Punjabi MC in there. That's a classic. I mean, I, I I don't know. Maybe it's overplayed, but I love that song. So I'm like, yes. I love what I saw. Anyway, Jabby, over to you. No, keep going. Keep going. 
Why? I want to hear more of what you thought. Why? Because I'm curious about what's in a char ha uh, char's hair, a char's brain. I'll tell you what's in my hair product. Okay. Um, what's in my brain is I, I thought this looked really, really cool. Um, it it's really exciting just to kind of see Dev Patel in this sort of role. It's also super cool that it is produced by Jordan Peele as well, and Dev Patel is directing this. So obviously, this is something that he is really excited to do, and that he he's probably been wanting to do this type of thing for a while and so he's like cool I'll direct it and everything and it it looks awesome I mean obviously I'm not the one to talk about the martial arts or the stunts because I don't know anything about that stuff apart from like I think something looks cool and I'll say it I liked the way that he was moving in this and I liked what they were doing with the action okay yeah so this definitely has a, a bitchin vibe I like the vibe overall I like the idea. I like the story. I like Dev Patel a lot. I think he's a very talented dude. Yeah. I think that he's very good at immersing himself into a character and like, this is who this guy is and he's that dude. I buy him as that guy. He's one of those actors who's pretty good at doing that. Mm. Um, now, I have never seen him do action. The closest thing to it that I saw him do was actually a movie that I watched by myself called The Wedding Guest mm. ages ago. And I actually liked him in that. Even though I didn't love the movie, I thought he was pretty cool. I think Jim Sarb was in that as well. As far as this goes, I like the color palette and everything. One of the biggest challenges you can do as an actor is direct yourself. <laughs> it's it's yeah. one of the hardest things you could possibly do is you got to be behind the camera and in front of the camera. And the fact that he still has that, you know, charisma and power to him while directing himself, it speaks volumes about him and his talents. Yeah. The fight scenes. They're doing a lot of tricks here to, to make it look good. They're going for that raid vibe or somewhere in between the raid and born identity. You know what I'm saying? Sure. Like they're going for that kind of vibe, which I like. I like the kind of brutal, that looks like it hurts kind of fight scenes, as opposed to, I've kind of grow, moved away from the flowery, Kung Fu Cinema Shaw Brothers fight scenes. You sure. know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, more towards the, uh, not complete realism, but more towards realism. Not that there's anything wrong with the Shaw Brothers style. I still appreciate it, but this is definitely more my speed right now. And so that said, I could see when things were just not momentum enough, if that makes any sense. Like it, it just looked like choreography sometimes as opposed to these two dudes look like they're throwing down. Sure. That's the thing I was picking up on and that's that's in the trailer. And so that's what has me a little bit concerned is that when I'm watching this in a three, four minute fight scene, each instance, it's gonna look like, you know what I mean? I'm not feeling like I'm in it enough because I'm seeing that they're doing choreography. That's my one apprehension and my, my, my one concern. That aside, the like I said, the action otherwise, the vibe otherwise, the music, even though you said it's kind of been played a lot, like just the overall energy of it. It's a classic. I, I like the overall energy of the trailer and I, I'm very excited about it. I, it makes me quite curious as to how Jordan Peele and Dev Patel teamed up on this. Like this is obviously a passion project for Dev Patel and I, I just wonder how that conversation came about. Like Dev Patel and him happened to meet and he's like, yo, there's this thing I really want to do. And Jordan Peele's like, I'll help you do it. It feels a, like a bit different than what Jordan Peele has been doing to date. And so I think it's cool that- For both of them. Well, yeah, that they're kind yeah. of branching out and doing something that maybe they're not really known for doing yet. But also I, I just really like the comedy as well. That was cool as well. Yeah, I, I mean, it, it caught me off guard. See, that's why I was thinking of Born Identity a little bit because what he was about to do was straight from Born Identity. Like, maybe not the jumping through the glass, but usually Jason Bourne is like jumping through like a balcony or something. Yeah. But he has jumped through windows as well. And so like that was straight from Jason Bourne. And to contrast it like that and say, well, he's not quite there yet. Like it's a journey to being that guy. It wouldn't surprise me if later on in the film, you have a moment where he jumps through a window successfully and like does a three point landing and all that stuff. Yeah, no, know? I mean, it, it looks cool. And of course, I'm, I'm super excited that it's set in India as well. A part of me, I didn't say this and I'm only saying this now that we're like well into the discussion so that like none of you guys can crucify me but when I first saw him kind of playing this character who I gather is like low status right I was kind of like oh it's the Slumdog Millionaire sequel that we never got but it's obviously not that's the only similarity is that he's playing someone who is like very much sure. working class yeah that's true yeah it's not directed by a British white guy this time it's directed no, by it's, Dev Patel it's directed an by an Indian <laughs> 
<laughs> British guy. Yeah, that's better. But yeah, no, it's better. And like, I, I love, I love that you know we're seeing familiar faces in there as well. And like, if this does not end on a dance number, I will be pissed. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You need a Jai Ho. <laughs> yeah, Jai, exactly. <laughs> just like Slumdog Millionaire. Yeah. No, this is very exciting. I, I, I think that Deb Patel is super, super talented, and I did not like Green Knight. Oh, The Green Knight. I didn't like that movie. Uh, so, uh, you know, shame on Dev Patel for that. But most people like him. Most people like that him in that movie. Most people like that movie. I hated that movie. There I were it things was, I liked in that movie. I yeah. thought it was awful. <laughs> and I'm not afraid to t- tell Dev Patel that. <laughs> I hope Terrible he sees, movie. I, I hope he sees this. No. Uh, no. <laughs> I thought he was good in it. I just didn't like the movie. It was a very beautiful movie. But like, I was It was a very boring, irritating movie. Okay. But um, anyway, Monkey Man. I'm excited about this. I'm excited about what is in store. Yeah. And um, I would imagine that when he's in the monkey head, he's probably got a stunt double, which frees him up to just get behind the camera. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Um, yeah, that, that's actually a really good point. And I think I'm excited to just see like, you know, a brown superhero on the big screen, front we, and center. We have one. Her name is Miss Marvel. Right. But I'm excited to see a dude do it too. Plus this looks... This the looks, future is female this Achara. Looks, this looks like so much more like, uh, you know what I mean? Than Miss Marvel. And and I love Miss Marvel. So like, I'm, I'm just like... More I, of this, please. I felt more threatened seeing the pan in your hand. The what? The pan in your hand. Oh, the pan in my hand. Yeah. Hmm. You should be, because I know how to wield a frying pan, okay? While he's shouting Thai obscenities. That's right. That's a bachelor party reference. You guys, thanks so much for hanging out. I'm Jabby Koi. This is... Achara Cook. Peace out.